With a long coastline, high population density, and economic assets concentrated in coastal lowlands and deltas, Vietnam is considered one of the most vulnerable countries in the world to climate change. Lap River and the ponds in Hue City suffer from poor water quality. The river water has become narrow, inhibiting the flow and accumulating heavy sediments. The ponds, because of lack of daily water recirculation, have been reduced to standing water. The way the embankments is built also discourages people from interacting with the water or natural environment. Sen Pond in Lap River in Hue City were case study sites funded by international donors such as Asian Development Bank to visualize the spatial outcome of adopting new types of edge treatments and water sensitive urban design tools to help improve water quality and generate vibrant community spaces. WSUD is a relatively new urban development approach in developing Asian cities and its application involves integration of the water cycle management within the built environment through urban planning and design. At Sen Pond more community gathering points were strategically introduced to encourage people water contact. Steps, platform, and boardwalks bring diverse experiences along the water's edge, and together with aquatic plant uptake, low-cost water circulation system helped improve the water quality. Viewing decks were introduced at potential public gathering spots along the Rapp River. A major stretch of the natural green edge is suggested to be preserved for existing trees and ecological value. In addition, riprap and gobbions have been introduced at suitable locations that need strong slope reinforcement. By incorporating the process of the water cycle and nature intentionally, the city could secure the water resources and improve water quality. In addition, the community itself became more vibrant. This gives you an idea how you can gain benefits from considering nature when designing a city in the landscape.